Are you struggling with your video files that are MKV and you'd like to convert them to MP4? Well, in this video, we're gonna show you how to convert MKV to MP4 for free using a free piece of software called Handbrake. Maybe your video editor is not accepting those MKV files and you need them converted over to MP4. It's really easy to do with this software. But hey, if you're new here, my name is Ken and this is Northern Viking Every Day. And we bring you videos on reviews and how to's. So please consider subscribing so you don't miss out on any upcoming videos. Let's go ahead and jump right over to my computer and show you how to convert those video files. All right, so here we are on my computer. If you don't have Handbrake already, you can download it for free from their website, handbrake.fr. I will put a link below in the description so you can easily download it. And I've been using this software for years. Now, if you go to downloads here at the top, you can download it for Mac, Windows, and Linux. Just go ahead and download that and install it. Now, on my desktop here, I do have a video file. It's called Victoria Fisherman's Wharf. This one is an MKV file. If I right click on it and head to properties here and details, we can take a look and you can see that this is an MKV video file right there. If I play that, it's just some footage of the Victoria, British Columbia, Canada's Fisherman's Wharf. There's some great restaurants and different boutiques out here that you can check out. Now, let me go ahead and close that. Let's go ahead and open up Handbrake. I happen to have a desktop icon here. If you don't have a desktop icon, you can search for it in your programs in your start menu or wherever your programs live. Now, once you've got Handbrake open, it looks something like this. You can actually drag and drop your file right in this gray area, or you can click on file here and search your computer for the file you're looking for. Now, I'm just gonna close that. We're gonna drag and drop this MKV file over to this gray section and just drop it in there and it's gonna upload it right into the software. Now, from here, we need to select some settings. So there's a few different settings. I'm not gonna go through all the settings because there's a ton of them in this software, um, but they do have some presets right here. So if you click on presets, there is a drop down menu here. If you're not seeing this as a drop down menu, you might have to click on presets here in the top right hand corner and that will appear for you. And once you're in here, you can just hover over to this drop down menu and it gives you a whole bunch of different options. Very fast, fast, um, HQ, Super HQ. There's some other formats, Discord, Gmail, Vimeo, um, Android, Apple, Chromecast, PlayStation, etc. For the purposes of this video, I'm gonna just select very fast 1080p, but go ahead and select the one that suits you and you can play around with whichever one you like. This video was also recorded in 1080p. So I'm gonna select that one. Now what we need to do is make sure that we have MP4 selected here. So there's MKV or WebM, we want MP4 selected here. And we can go down to the bottom here and you can see that it shows you a save as file and you click on browse here on the right hand side and you can select where your file is gonna go. So I'm gonna go ahead and select desktop. You can find a folder on your computer wherever you like and you can select that. And let's go ahead and rename our file to whatever we like. You can leave it the same if you want. I'm gonna call this one um, converted. And I'm just gonna, right here it says save as file type. You can select MP4 here as well and just go ahead and hit save. Now, one thing you'll notice at the bottom here, it says save as, and it's got the file name. It says M4V and not MP4. Now I'm just gonna head on back to Handbrake's website and I'll put a link to this document below in the description as well. It says MP4 versus M4V. They are the exact same file. The only difference is the extension MP4 versus M4V. And you can simply change the file extension from MP4 to MP M4V in the um, in the extension at the bottom. So let's go ahead and go back to Handbrake. So what it's saying we can do, if you want M4V, you can leave it like that, or you can change it to MP4. So just at the bottom here where it says M4V, just change that to MP4, like that. And we're all done. Now we just need to encode this video file and, and we can watch it in MP4. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hit encode here at the top, start encode. Now, if you have a whole bunch of, you, of them that you wanna do, you could actually hit add to queue and then go ahead and do another video file. We're just gonna do one. So I'm gonna hit start encode here and it's gonna start encoding that video file. I'm just gonna minimize the website in the background and it's gonna be done that. It says queue is finished and you can see the converted file here showed up on our desktop. If I go ahead and right click on this file, 
and go to properties again and we'll go to details and now you can see that this is a 1080p, 1080p video file and if I scroll all the way down you can see it's mp4 so let's go ahead and play that and it all looks good in mp4 and it's really that simple to convert your mkv video files to mp4 for free in handbrake so hope this video was able to help you out in converting your mkv video files to mp4s for free using handbrake if it did make sure to give this video a thumbs up also remember to connect with me on social media you will find all those links below in the description thank you so much for watching today and until next time take care